Well, the Mikai is one fine conference on AI that is really recognized now all over the, uh, the world. So I can only say that Mikai has become a major AI conference. And because the proceedings are published by Springer Berlag, Springer Berlag has such a great reputation on as a scientific uh, venue. So the idea that you publish in Mikai is very important. Now, I have published a couple papers in Mikai and Mikai 2005, 2007. And yes, you can get access to the various um, uh, publications of Mikai through Spring Berlin, and that is pretty good. So it's one of the top AI conferences in the world now. Now, that's a long story that I have to make here because when we founded the uh, Society of Artificial Intelligence in Mexico in 1986, of course, there was no, uh, there was no Mikai then. Not only that, we had had a national meeting every year uh, beginning in 1983 in, um, Guanajuato, uh, the first uh, the first time was in Guanajuato 1983. Then we went to um, Oaxaca and then we went to Puebla. And so we kept building up on that. It was not until we also did the, um, the Iberamia, which was the conference between Latin America and Spain. And we did that one in uh, Michoacán and then we did it in Barcelona and then we did it in Madrid and we did it in many places and even Brazil. But then by 2000, the then president, Paco Cantu, uh, converted the uh, National Conference on AI as an international conference on AI. After they have, he had successfully organized the uh, IJKI in Acapulco. So he created the Mikai then. And the Mikai was initially a two, uh, every two years conference, and then it became to be a one year conference, every year conference. So that is what I can say that I did participate in the organization of the first meetings, but that was long time ago, 1986 to 2000. Well, the community of AI has been a very solid and dedicated community in the computer science field. And I would say uh, by the work of many other researchers that AI has been the arrowhead of research in computer science in Mexico. So AI and Mikai for that, has become the particular venue where everybody publishes every year what they're doing. But the, re, re, the implications of this are farther more important, not just for AI, but also for computer science. If you're a computer scientist in Mexico, you must have heard about Mikai because Mikai is a well-recognized uh, research-oriented uh, conference. Now, the other important thing is that the trend of AI has become so important to our daily life and now through this COVID thing, we see that even today is even more relevant because all the trends that have gone uh, initially uh, regular classical AI now they went to genetic algorithms, then it went to uh, machine learning, and all of them have been always present in the various conferences of the Mikai. Now, it's difficult to get a paper published in Mikai because the peer review process is a very difficult one. So there are very few papers that are really published. So it's a top rank uh, or, uh, conference.
Well, as I said that a moment ago, AI is the arrowhead of computer science research in Mexico. Not just in Mexico, but all over the world. I would say that for the new generations of students of computer science, they will have to go into uh, AI. Now, AI has different names now, and now with a talk about data science, they talk about machine learning, they talk about deep learning, they talk about many topics, but all of them are covered on this this big blanket of umbrella called AI that actually deals with understanding how to make machines intelligent. Now, that how really has to do with us making that intelligence. That is, as I always say to my students, working with computers is like like magic. They work like magic. Yes, and I say it, it is true. It's like magic. But for magic to occur, there has to be a magician. And you are a magician. You are the magician. So if you want to study computer science and you want to become a magician, yes, magic will be created. So, but it takes a lot of patience and a lot of persistence, specifically in AI, you have to keep on trying, trying and trying to figure out the new ways to make machines more intelligent. Well, the other thing is now that Mikai will be for the first time celebrated virtually because of this COVID conference. So, and it will be held in Mexico uh, in the Pan American University through Zoom. So therefore, I do invite everyone to join through papers to research this conference. And you can look for it, you can uh, search for it over the internet and you will find Mikai everywhere. Please do participate because it is a leading conference and there are very few papers will be accepted because of the hard peer review process that I just uh, stated. So we will be very happy to have you participate this year in the Mikai for the 20th time. Thank you very much. <laughs>